The ever fascinating and ever admired balls of plasma have more to them than what meets the eye. Yes, we are talking about stars. Although one might think that all they do is twinkle and give hope for a brighter future, some of these marvels are so unique that they have left astrophiles dumbstruck. These magnificent lights in the sky are formed when regions of dust and gas in the galaxy collapse due to gravity. As you know, the nearest star to us is the Sun, but we can still see some of these sparkling giants because of their large distances from us, making them appear as fixed points of light. Our universe is home to billions of trillions of stars. In our Milky Way alone, there are almost 100 million stars. However, our galaxy is just one among the trillion others. Every so often, scientists stumble upon some weird ones that render them speechless and make them question everything they know about the stellar life cycle. Usually, when we talk about stars, we know that they are old. But did you know that scientists discovered a star that is so old that it surpasses the age of the universe itself. Let's talk about this star from before the dawn of time. When HD 140283, a subgiant star 190 light years from Earth, was first spotted and studied, it posed something of a paradox. It appeared to be 16 billion years old, 2 billion years older than the universe itself. Subsequent observations reduced this age to 13.7 billion years, meaning it would have formed only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Its age earned this fascinating anomaly the nickname Methuselah's star, after the oldest man in the Bible. The first sign of its geriatric nature was that it contained 250 times less iron than the Sun suggesting it had formed at a time before the universe became suffused with heavy elements from supernova. Because it was most likely one of only the second generation of stars, known as Population 2 stars, astronomers can learn about the galaxy's early days by studying its chemical composition. Here's another mind-boggling star. Normally, when astronomers set their sights on a spiral arm structure, they are looking at the galaxy, but that is not the case with SAO 206462. This star located 460 light years from Earth was discovered during an exoplanet search using the Subaru telescope in Hawaii. But rather than finding fully fledged planets around the young star, astronomers instead discovered planets still in formation. The youthful planets are growing out of a circumstellar disk of gas and dust which extends out to 80 AU, twice the orbit of Pluto. Isn't that fascinating? At least two of these planets have shepherded the disk into its unusual shape, with a different planet responsible for each arm. Some other stars have spellbinding secrets hidden inside them. We are talking about a star in the enrapturing constellation of Centaurus. At first, it appeared to be a dim white dwarf, but it subsequently turned out to be incredibly dense, with a mass of the Sun crammed into an object only a third the diameter of Earth. It is also remarkably cool, with a core temperature of a mere 6,600 degrees Celsius. You might think that that is a lot, but Here's the catch. Our very own sun has a temperature of 15 million degrees Celsius. So comparatively, this star is a lot cooler. At these sorts of temperatures, stars begin to vibrate and astronomers can use these vibrations to peer inside a star. In this case, they found that the star's carbon core had crystallized to form a diamond 10 billion trillion trillion carats in size. The star was later nicknamed Lucy after the Beatles song, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. It's a very aptly named, don't you think so? Since the discovery of Lucy, several other crystallized stars have been found, some with diamond hearts the size of Earth. A few other stars don't abide by the rules of normality at all. 
The star Vega is a familiar sight to any Northern Hemisphere astronomer. This bright and enchanting hunk of plasma is definitely one you cannot miss. But if we got to see the bright star from a different angle, we'd have a very different view. Because Vega was squashed. Vega's bulging waistline, its high ablateness, is caused by a high spin rate. It rotates once every 12 and a half hours. This throws material out around its equator. Because this stellar material is farther from the star's core, it experiences less gravity, causing it to cool and darken, a phenomenon known as gravity darkening. As Vega faces Earth, pole end on, it still looks round to us, but its dark halo is a telltale sign of a cooler equator and an oblate shape. Interesting, isn't it? Here's a crazy one. There is a giant in our galaxy, waiting to burst and send a wave of hot gas and radiation towards Earth. That star is WR104. WR104 is a wolf rayet, a star at the precarious point in its life before it goes supernova. The core has no helium left to burn. Instead, WR104 is forced to churn through heavier elements such as oxygen, which upsets the careful balance between gravity and fusion inside it, causing the star to shed its outer layers. When the oxygen finally runs out, which could happen tomorrow or a thousand years from now, the star will go supernova. However, this cosmic firework show that will accompany this phenomenon will be a bit different. WR104 is one half of a binary pair, and the two stars feed into each other, spinning up their stellar winds until they are going incredibly fast. Some scientists think the explosion will align with the axis of spin, which is pointing directly at us. Say what? While we are far enough away that even a directed supernova won't hurt us, there is a potential part of the explosion that could be deadly. A gamma ray burst, or GRB. Luckily, it takes a very specific and unlikely chain of events for a wolf rayet to create GRB. And even if it does, WR104 might be pointed far enough away to miss us. Even so, astronomers will be keeping a close eye on this 7,800 light year distant star, just in case. That's reassuring. Want to know more about a mysterious star that won't die? Well, wait no further. A supernova, the explosions of stars, all get bright and then fade within a few months, says Arcavi, an observational astronomer from the University of California, Santa Barbara. When his team first discovered the stellar burst IPFT14HLS, it was already beginning to fade away. But then, like something out of a mythical story, it rose from the dead and brightened once more. Zheng Wang, who noticed the brightening, asked me whether that was normal and I said absolutely not, Arkavi opened. Cheng Wang is another astronomer at the university. A surprising tidbit about a supernova is that it almost never gets brighter again after having faded, but this star went on to fade and brighten at least five times in total, deepening the mystery. The puzzle continued to deepen when they measured the supernova spectrum. A spectrum is a rainbow of light which reveals the velocity, composition and temperature of a star. The supernova was evolving 10 times slower than other stars meaning that when it looked 60 days old, its actual age was 600 days. It might have been even older, as another supernova had been recorded in the same spot in 1954. We've never seen two explosions in the same point in the sky, separated by 60 years before, Arkavi said. Each of the peculiar properties is hard to explain on its own, and even harder to explain altogether. IPTF14HLS breaks all the theoretical modules of supernova behavior we have, he added. In an attempt to make head and tail of this peculiar case, several suggestions have come up for what's causing the odd behavior. 
the supernova could be colliding with surrounding material which then glows or it could be IPTF 14 HLS is actually a massive star shredding material to hold off its own collapse. But neither solution seems to explain everything. Even today this case remains a mystery. If you thought that that was the last mystery in the starry world, you would be so wrong. The citizen scientists of the Planet Hunters website found a very unusual exoplanet around the star KIC 8462852. There is a star that appears to be typical in every way you look at it, with the exception of its light curve. That's how its brightness changes with time. It is characterized by asymmetric irregular dimming, lasting days, weeks, months and sometimes decades. Not only was the pattern of dimming irregular, but the brightness dropped by as much as 22% far greater than if a planet had passed in front of it and blocked out the light. But there was one explanation that captured the public's imagination. Was the star the home of a giant alien structure? Because naturally, when something unexplainable happens, our first thought is aliens. However, scientists say that if there was a solid structure, the dimming would show up as uniform across all wavelengths, but the observations revealed that whatever was obscuring the star, it was at least partly transparent. The latest data indicates that the brightness dips are consistent with dust, but it is yet to be determined where this dust is and how it got there. That was a lot you guys. Which of these captivating celestial bodies surprised you the most? If you liked the video, show us your support by liking the video and pressing the subscribe button. See you on the next video.